So today's video is about knife skills and the recipe that I will be doing is from the website Tablespoons. It's the creamy Italian sub salad. Um, this recipe is good because the cucumbers contain antioxidants, they have a high water content, and they may help with lowering blood sugar. Tomatoes have great source of vitamin C and K and potassium. The red onions are another good antioxidant and it fights inflammation. The black olives are also another antioxidant and it contains a good fat and it's a link to the increase of good cholesterol. And the kale, of course, a superfood, has protein, fiber, vitamins A, C, and K. So stay tuned. Since I'm doubling this recipe, I will be using two seasoning packets instead of one to make the dressing. And this is two. Instead of using one third cup of mayo, I'll be using two thirds also. That's two thirds. Two spoons of white vinegar. We're going to use six for this recipe. Instead of two tablespoons of olive oil, we're going to do four. And then you're going to mix this until it's smooth, and then you're going to put it in the fridge to chill while the pasta is still cooking. This is kale from the farmer's market. So here we have a fresh cucumber. It's clean as well. We're going to cut the cucumber on a bias. So... Serrated knife instead of the chef's knife. Be halving the tomatoes, just cutting them in half. I think it will be best to use a serrated knife also to cut these. And but we will be using one half today since I um doubled the recipe in ways and increased some of the other things. So, cut that part off. I'm gonna leave this part on. We're gonna cut the whole onion in half. With everything still on. That's how I prefer to cut my onion. So like this, you wanna keep your hands flat fingers all the way out and just go in with your chef's knife and cut. As you can see, I'm still working on the skill. slice the meat I'll use a different cutting board for I am a vegetarian so I will not be putting meat in the entire salad but I will still slice meat for my parents since this is an Italian sub salad 10 to 12 pieces for them and just slice it roughly so they could put it on top of their salad so as you can see I have a clean cutting board we don't want cross-contamination. I'm a vegetarian. I do not eat meat. So I definitely do not want any of it near my vegetables or anything. So...
Now that everything is has been tossed together, the sauce, the pasta, the tomatoes, everything except for the salami, you can now serve it.